Marv, why don't you think we get nominee? I'm going to say me. I think people miss McLovin a whole ton. Do you really mean that? Hell no, I don't mean that. <laughs> yeah. You've made this a better show, so it's not you. When I saw your text and it just said one word, and I didn't even look at it. I didn't even look at uh, the nominations, and I was like, damn. And my wife was like, don't worry, no one will bring it up. I was like, huh. <laughs> <laughs> she knew here? Even though they finished third, I think Sac's the underdog. Golden State, they were bumpy all year, but to end up in the sixth spot, and you just trust them in the playoffs. Golden State is going to be a tough out because they know what it takes. They can lock down. They can go on those stops. They can go on those runs that are historic, right? And I think they still have that switch, and, and they're out to prove it for sure. I've got him as the number two ranked player in this class behind Bryce Young. I haven't talked to a team, and I'm talking probably close to a dozen teams that have him outside the top five. Now, where does he fall? That's yeah. that's the fascinating part. And I I still hold this out. Dallas is sitting at 26. It wouldn't shock me if they made a splash, jumped up into the teens ahead of teams like Detroit and, and the Chargers and went and get, got Bijan maybe around like 14, 15, 16.